Um, a brown dwarf starts out effectively the same way, a collapsing cloud of gas and dust as well. But it doesn't have as much mass to begin with, we think. So the idea for a brown dwarf is that you start out with just a smaller cloud of gas and dust. It, it collapses, it forms a disk as well, but you don't have enough mass at the core to create a high enough temperature and pressure to ignite that stable hydrogen fusion. Um, I, I sometimes use the analogy that it's kind of like a car turning over, a, a, a gas-powered car turning over. I realize that my analogy is gonna be outdated eventually. It's the, the engine turns over when you turn the key, but it never quite catches and the engine never quite turns on. So brown dwarfs can form and fuse some things that are a little bit easier to fuse than hydrogen, lithium, deuterium, um, but they won't ever stably fuse hydrogen into their, in their cores. So they won't ever create their own energy like a star does. They just kind of cool and fade with time. And so you can see they become kind of dark and stripy um, and they're, they're out there in space.